Hello, in this video I would like to show you how to build a price and volume filter. What we're going to look for is shares that have had a large price movement but a small volume. Often when a share has had a big price movement but not an accompanying large volume, uh, it's often an indication that there aren't enough investors that think that the price should be going in that direction and could be an indication that the price might correct the next day. So to build a filter we go to filter, apply filter, we press new, we give the filter a name, we click on OK and OK again. The filter will be applied to whichever list you have open at the time. At the moment I have the FTSE 350 open, but you could apply it to any list in the program. I hit add criteria and I'm looking for low volume. So to look for low volume, what I'm going to do is compare the current volume for today against its average. So under the price section, I scroll down and I'll find volume for today. In order to compare it with the average I press combine items, I select percentage change from, then I hit select, I go to technical, select average volume and enter how many periods I want the average to be calculated over. I will do 63, 63 trading days, as you see it says daily here, that will be equal to three months. So it will be the average volume over the last three months. I click on OK. So now we have the volume today as a percentage change from the average volume over the last 63 days. I click on OK. And I then want to set what my minimum maximum values are. I don't want any minimum, but I do want to set a maximum of zero. I I want to be the I want to be, I want today's volume to be below the average volume over the last three months. The second criteria is going to be a price movement criteria. So I press add criteria again. I go to price and under price change I'll see from close. This is going to be the percentage change between the current price and yesterday's close. I click on OK and here I want a minimum of three. So it will only find shares that have risen by a minimum of three percent today. I then click the apply button and here are the four shares in the FTSE 350 that have had a large price movement of at least 3% and a low volume. Uh, I can then select one of the results, zoom in and this is a perfect example. We have a 3.1% movement of, on the day but the volume as you can see is extremely low. If we look at uh, another share, Free Eye Group, for example, we'll see another very large price movement, but not an accompanying large volume. Remember, this kind of filter is uh, works best if you view it towards the end of a trading day, because if you look at it at say nine o'clock in the morning, most shares will have a lo low volume just naturally. But if you look at it around four o'clock in the afternoon and you still see a very low volume for these shares, it might indicate that tomorrow there's going to be a price correction. In this filter, I've shown you upwards price movement, but you can easily change it to a downwards price movement by instead of setting a minimum of a 3% rise, you can set a maximum 3% fall and then hit apply. This is the end of our tutorial and uh, thank you for listening and goodbye.